So, oh! Why did I do that much? Why did I one-shot? How did I one- I'm not gonna question it. Okay. Let's do this. Let's continue with this uh, Vex Caliber Balance team. Continue battling. I hate your flutter main, GG. Good game, well played. Were you in the stream for that first turn? That first turn was a little sussy. I'm not gonna lie, little big. That first turn was a little bit sus. I think you I think you might have I think you might have caught the stream. Anyways, you at least got to catch the end of it when I said I will throw this whole game over this joke. <laughs> okay, uh ooh. Ooh, you go crazy. You go crazy. Um I also get a lot of value out of just like leading off at the boy. Flutter. Ting Lu has a little bit of anti-synergy, to be honest, and I'm not like a big fan of that. Um, Terra Poison, eh, yeah, I don't get a lot out of you. We're gonna have to go with these guys. The usual crew. Jolden go. Probably Terra Water Jolden go. TBH. Probably the Terra Water variant. Um, I'm gonna protect on the first one, and I'm actually just gonna go ahead and E speed, assuming that they want to go for Terra Water. Or actually, hmm. Uh, Let's go for it. There's there's no reason not to. Let's just go for it. Yeah, that's what I thought. Just wanted to hop in after I match. Right, thank you, little big. I appreciate it. Good game. Good game. All right. So how much value am I am I gonna get out of Terra Grass? On the, uh, on the, on the, on the, on the, on the ruin. Uh, probably not that much. I'm gonna get rid of Town Flame. I could Terra Water here. I don't think it's worth it. Extreme Speed plus E Speed probably does it. And I think they want to Terra Water. I think they're just not gonna Terra Water. Okay. Can I KO? Thank you. I was gonna say if they don't Terra Water here, I'm I'm throwing. Pretty sure eat that. All right. Your life orb. Good to know. Good to know. Go into the roaring moon. Okay. Um. Unless it's clear amulet, I don't think we have much of an issue. Okay. Booster energy. I'm gonna go ahead and save my arcanine for this. I'm gonna protect and go right into our guy. You can eat the hit for sure. I didn't get I can get the Arcanine back in for an intimidate. Also, were they speed booster? Chat, help me out. Help me out. Yeah, help me out here, chat. Were they speed booster or attack boosting? I wasn't paying attention. Because I was too busy thinking about like. Do I save the Arcanine or not? Breaking swipe? That's fine. I'm not I'm not here to deal damage. <laughs> Shadow Ball should bounce off of me. Attack boosting, yeah, it's gonna be an Arcanine turn. It's gonna be an Arcanine turn. Also, I just get like a lot of value out of this. I'd imagine they want to protect the Golden Ghost, so I'm actually gonna go for the Fissure into the Roaring Moon. I don't think they tear a fly here ever. Because if they protect the Golden Go here. My Fissure doesn't get boosted, or my, my Stop Me Tantrum doesn't get boosted the next turn. But Fissure on the, uh, <laughs> on the Roaring Moon seems fine. Alright, who are you going into? Great Tusk. Glad I'm intimidating now. Glad I'm saving my Palafin, too. Nice little Intimidate here.
All right, they're going to terror flying on me, aren't they? That's fine. My stomping tantrum still goes crazy. Don't be terror flying. Be like terror stupid. They're terror flying. They're, they're not terror stupid. I made that up. That's not a real thing. I'm sorry, guys. I lied to you. I really did. I lied to you. Terror stupid's not real. I'll take it. That's a free switch into the Palafin. <laughs> That's a free Palafin switch, baby. Also, they're almost out of Tailwind turns. They're out of Tailwind turns. I'm actually just going to go ahead and do this. Yeah, that, this is fine. This is fine. Special attack boost. Um, I can tear a water here, but I don't get much value out of it, to be honest. Let's go ahead and... I'm going to Moonblast Great Tusk. And go into the Palafin. If there's Scarf, I should be fine. Since it's Intimidated. Looks like there's Sash. That's good, too. Acrobatics. Shouldn't KO my Flutter. Nice. They close combat. That's interesting. I don't think they do that. Um, luckily, I actually threatened this guy pretty hard just by doubling into the um, the Roaring Moon here, which I think I'm going to do that. Will this do it? I believe in him. I believe in him. Alright, no protect, unfortunate, but this is still just gonna KO you. And if they uh if they end up leaving my Flutter Main alone, I'm I'm like solid. However, they are Sash, so they're probably gonna like Earthquake here. Tinglu still probably cleans up. Rock Slide. Miss both of them. Yeah, that's fine. I only need to hit one of you. I only need to hit one of you, to be fair. There's Joel Dango. And my player is pretty safe. Shadow Ball you. Jet Punch you. No Protect coming out from this thing. That's interesting. And I'm booster energy, so this should just KO. Nice. Good game. Solid showing. Solid showing. Terra Water, Strong Jaw, Boosted, Ficious Rend. Yeah, I, I, I can deal with... I can do without getting Dracovish back for a while. I can I can do without it. That being said, Dracovish Ting Lu feels real. Dracovish Iron Bundle will be real. Oh, I hate that, dude. I hate that. Why is that a thing? Okay. Dracozolt in snow? You mean Arctazolt? Arctazolt in snow feels dangerous. Alright, I always have to bring you. You are unfortunately mandatory here uh, as well as you. Uh, we're going to go ahead and bring the Flutter, and I think my last Mon is going to have to be... Let's go Bax. Let's go Bax. Let's go with the Bax. Palafin versus Dondozo is like, what is my purpose? You click Haze. I 
I'll take it. That's a burn. That's a burn if I've ever seen one. Boost your energy flutter. Um, tells me it's also speed boosting. Let's go ahead and protect here. They have to like double my Arcanine to get this KO. And even then, it might not get it. Uh, this burn's pretty important to winning, though. I'd imagine with this lead, there's still a chance they're Dozo Giri in the back, but that also guarantees they're not going to switch. Paranormal. Yep. Cool. Poggers. This burn is very important now. This is going to hurt. All right, cool. They didn't double. As long as I connect, I'm gaming. Awesome. Let's see if they're Lumberry. Probably not. I think they're just going to be choice ban on this team. Nice. I'll take it. I'll take it. I have to keep Palafin alive, because late game Palafin feels like busted busted. Um, I don't lose my Arcanine if it stays in. I think what I do here is I just go... I go hard back Excalibur, it's like the most expendable Pokemon. And I'm going to attempt to Flare Blitz this thing. Because I'm not really scared of the Dragonite anymore. Chiyu, okay, that's basically guarantees no Dozo. Probably, it might be Geary. They might have brought, like, Scarf Geary in the back. But if my uh, Bax manages to survive this hit, I get to go for Ice Shard next turn, which is really big. Deagleam, he's not going to live. He lived! Crazy. Okay, I'm in a really good spot, because this is going to bring it... Oh, I was going to say it's going to bring it into range of Ice Shard, but, um... <laughs> Not necessary. <laughs> Not necessary, I guess. It's gonna knock me out though, right? Did it? It did not. Okay. Well, I'll take it. I'll take it. Dragonite Paldea Champion. Yeah, this uh, this Dragonite's not doing anything for the rest of this match. Let's go ahead and I think we're good to sack both of these guys, more or less. Uh, I can protect here, actually. Because I just need to get my Palafin in, and we're like gaming. I can attempt to extreme speed you. Break a sash if possible. I'd imagine they want to extreme speed the backs. No. Oh, yeah, I guess no extreme speed. That's fine. I'm gonna lose my Arcanine here, but I broke a possible sash. Also, they have a really slow Arcanine. Wow. Or not Arcanine, uh Dragonite. Cool. And that's all I really needed, to be honest. We're like set. Get in my Palafin. I can now Jet Punch that um, Chi Yu and get my Fluttermane in next to the Palafin because it's always going to be safe. They either have to switch, protect, or lose their guy. Positioning here is just going crazy. It's going crazy. We're gaming. Jet Punch always KOs. Unless they're bold, max defense, max HP with a Wakan Berry, I think is the item. Not Wakan. What's the berry? Also, Dreadful Ghost. I see that Pokey Paste. Let me go ahead and copy that link. All right. They're going to protect, like I said. They're kind of just stuck there. They're going to extreme speed. I don't really take much damage on my Palafin. All right, I got the team all loaded up for you for that team review after this. Hasho, that's the berry. Okay. Um, Dragonite Chiyu. I am good just to, like, start Moonblasting, to be honest. Actually, what I can do here... 
is they shouldn't eat a Moonblast on there, and I can just protect. Assuming they want to stay in. And extreme speed me. Yep, and this should KO because we're special attack boosting. We also know they're not Scarf because they protected last turn. Nice. Alright, and now we're in a pretty good spot. When the U is Chi. True. Very true, actually. Hold on, you're on to something. He's on to something there. Cool. Uh, Fluttermane shouldn't ever drop to this because of how bulky it is. I'm just going to double the Chen Pao and win. Eat. Great. They actually sucker my Palafin. That's a huge play. All right. However, I am still at full HP. So it's just a matter of getting rid of Chen Pao, and I, like, win. There's the backs. My play here is always to protect and Shadow Ball, or Moonblast, I mean. I never tear a water, that's just throwing. They didn't protect their Chen Pao. Should live this. Because they're going to want to, like, Ice Spinner me or something. Nice. No more, uh, no more crits from Chen Pao losing me these games. Alright, yeah, they can't win anymore. What do you think about the Murkrow comeback? I was actually gonna make a video about it. Might save my thoughts for that. Uh, might as well Glaive Rush. I think they're just gonna forfeit here, because they know. Watch them be bluffing the Choice Band this whole time, but to be fair, they've been doing way too much damage to bluff it. All right, good game. Evan, thanks so much for the resub. 14 months, thank you. Mustache is fire. You know, what do you guys think about the mustache? I think the mustache, it suits my current look of, you know, like, you can trust me to sell you a car, but also I might like stab you. <laughs> I'm joking, all right. All right. Let's see. Is this Jody's team? No, it's not. I just see a Corv. I see a Corviknight, and I think, oh, that's Jody. Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. Dreadful Ghost. Like, yeah, the uh, the icy wind plus Aqua Steps kind of kind of solid. Uh, looks like I get a ton of value out of Terra Grass on this guy. I'm gonna get a lot of value out of you too. We'll lead off with you and you. I think we have to bring you. Do I need Flutter this game? Flutter's questionable. I wanna bring the backs. I wanna bring the backs. I, I believe in the backs. Actually, no, we shouldn't bring backs. We should bring Flutter. Do I? I have to position very smart, but I think I bring Flutter. Backs bundle. Solid lead for me. Solid lead. Very solid lead. Unless it's clear amulet, in which case this lead sucks. Um. I don't think they ever icy wind here. Do this. Oh, 
All right, cool, cool. I'm cool with that. Orvanite. Mm, yeah, that's fine. Maybe I should have brought Arcanine. I think I should have brought Arcanine. Alright, they go for the pump. Yeah, that's that's an interesting call, I'm not gonna lie, dude. And I think here I'm always safe to target the bundle, but I may need a Terra Water. I actually might do something a little crazy. I'm gonna go Amoongus and I'm gonna protect. Because I think they're gonna wanna go for a protect and an iron head. I don't think they ever tailwind here. There's not really a point. They go for the Icy Wind. Are they gonna Icy Wind Iron Head? Should I Terra this next turn? I guess, yeah, I should Terra. Uh, they're never gonna freeze dry me. That did a lot though. Yeah, I'm gonna Terra. Um, and I protect the Amoongus. Actually, let's just get in Ting Lu. Minimize as much damage as possible. Terra, Moonblast, get rid of you. Cool, they didn't switch the bundle, but if they protect here, I'm in a bad spot. No terror from the bundle, it would have gone first. Alright, cool. Don't freeze me, I'll cry. Poggers. Get rid of arguably the most problematic Pokemon in this matchup, and we're in a good spot. That, they are banded Corviknight. I refuse to believe this is not Jody's banded Corviknight set. I refuse to believe this is not what I'm looking at. Alright. Let's get our guy off the field. Let's go into our Palafin. And I'm... I'm gonna protect... I can call out a Terra here. Or I can, like, I can scout a Terra. And if they're banded Corviknight, because that did too much to not be, like, banded. Alright, please do the Terra Fire. If you're Terra Fire, I'm in a really good spot. No, it's back, so I figured they want to Terra you. Terra Ground? I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm about to click the world's greatest jet punch of all time. Shouldn't take too much on Palafin, I think. Earthquake. Alright, maybe I did take too much. They iron head my... Palafin, that still does too much, bro. That's too much. Uh, I really don't want to do this. I really don't want to double the backs, but I think that if you're running this, it's pretty much guaranteed your AV. I think that's basically a guarantee your AV, so I'm going to go ahead and... Do they have any Moonblast switch-ins? Um, they don't have any Moonblast switch-ins. So I can Moonblast and Jet Punch. They ice shard me, I should live that. Iron Head might KO me, but I'd prefer this over any other outcome. And if I keep both of my Pokemon, I'm in a really good spot. Live! No. <laughs> Dude, alright, Corviknight being locked into Iron Head's nice. Um, even though it's like a pretty strong move. 
Uh, I have my outs now. Let's go ahead and go to, into Amoongus. There's Azu. Yep. My next turn is going to be very important. Hopefully they're not goggles. Please don't be goggles. Don't go, go, gadget, safety goggles me now. Don't you dare go, go, gadget, safety goggles on me. Come on. Iron head. Don't flinch, I'll cry. Play rough? Come on. No go, go, gadget, safety goggles. That's so bad. That's so bad, bro. Okay. I protected last turn. I can Rage Powder away the hit. I can't win. I can't win unless I get like a double protector. I guess I can go Ting Lu here and hope for the best. But I need this Spore to win. It's basically mandatory. Come on. They Aqua Jet me. I tank that pretty well. They're Life Orb. Good to know. That's good info. Iron Head, don't do this. Don't do this. Come on. Citrus Berry. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. Nice. That is good to know. Um... What now? I think they have to Iron Head this uh, Amoongus now. I think it's basically like the only play they can make. And I can go for the Fissure into the Azu. Get some health back on my Amoongus and Palafin should live this hit. I'm doing this for the regen. All right, land the fissure. Come on. They iron headed the Ting Lu. All right, don't flinch me. All right, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I get some regen. That's nice to know. I now have to double this Azu. Did I just lose off of that? I really thought they would go for the Amoongus there. This is like the only out I have. Don't wake up. So, oh! Why did I do that much? Why did I one shot? How did I what? I'm not gonna question it. No, not gonna question it. I will, I will count my blessings here. How did I one shot? Someone answer me how I just one shot that thing. Does it have no bulk? Is there just no bulk? I can't drop its defense, that's for sure. Literally impossible. Okay, well we won. Yeah, but I figured it'd take one, you know? That had to be a roll. I was going for the two shot. Nice. Goodbye. Goodbye. Alright, we got time for one more. I don't know how we did it, but we one-shot it. Maybe they didn't... Maybe they didn't hyper-train it? That's possible. All right, one more for the night. One more for the night.
rank 8,000 player. Um, this is just balance. Yeah, we're just backs balance mirror. Go ahead and lead off with Arcanine and you. Probably the most neutral lead. I get a lot of value out of my Fluttermane in this game. And I think that I can leave the Tingle at home and we'll go with the boy. We'll go with the boy. Are you going to raid Typhlosion after this match? No, uh, I'm going to do that on my own. Or maybe we'll do it for the stream on Saturday. We'll, we'll, we'll stream that on Saturday. I'm trying to do more variety on Saturdays now. Along with like general VGC laddering, you know. With no bulk, it is a roll not in your favor. How did I one-shot that Corviknight? How? Did you add in Mystic Water? Because I'm Mystic Water. Vax Gyarados, which one of you is Clear Amulet? One of you is Clear Amulet. Show me it. Open your mouth. Spit it out. Neither of them is clear. Like, okay, you know, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. Um, get a lot of value out of this Will O Wisp. Go into our own backs. I guess I could have gone Fluttermane, but I'm a little too scared to. I also don't think they're going to Glaive Rush turn one. I think it's a little too risky. Nice, get the burn off. Hopefully no hopefully no lumberry. They're lumberry. Okay, that sucks. Yeah, I'm adamant palafin. Cool, they glaive rush this thing. I'd rather take that over anything else. Uh, and they go for the thunder wave. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. So I can attempt another burn on this thing, and I think here I'm forced to Terra, unfortunately. Sorry, another Will-O-Wisp. And actually, uh, assuming they Glaive Rush, let's just go Flutter. Let's just go Flutter. They shouldn't go for a second Thunder Wave into that slot. They withdraw the Gyarados. Go into their own Flutter main. Booster... Speed. We see a lot of speed today. They go for the Protect. Okay, that's fine. This is a pretty neutral turn. Um, let's save our Arcanine. Let's just Protect here. And I'm actually going to go ahead and try to Terra Water. Terra Water Moonblast should come pretty close to KOing the Flutter Main, but Shadow Ball is a little bit more safe. However, if they Terra themselves... Hmm. I also can't really substitute. Let's just Moonblast and Terra Water. We're going to go into their Ting Lu. They go into their Amoongus. Okay, well, Sub's going to be my best friend in a second here. Especially if they didn't end up tearing. Looks like they didn't tear. I think I just get a KO. Unless they subbed. Because yeah, this uh this substitute on my side is gonna go crazy in a turn if I KO this flutter. Which I should, I think. Hopefully. They protect? Hmm. I don't like that. I don't like that. Um Here, I would say that their play is probably going to be to follow me, not follow me, but Rage Powder on my Arcanine, or Rage Powder on my on my Flutter main, and try to KO the Arcanine. So I'm actually just going to go for the sub anyways. 
because I'm not actually threatened by this flutter on my on my flutter, and I get a lot out of this sub. Moxie, how do you counter uh, Mouse Ape with this team? I would say you always lead off with uh, Flutter and you just lock in your Moonblast versus the Mouse. And what's the other tool that you use here? Oh, what are they doing? Arrow Water? Okay, uh, this is still fine. As long as I got this call right, this is still fine. Mm. Yeah, we're good. Get my sub off. Get my swag on. That's old school. Alright. Not a fan of the Terra Water. Can't lie. However, I am putting off a lot of pressure now. I'm actually going to go ahead and do this. They also might be under the impression I'm not safety goggles. I kind of just, I kind of uh, accidentally faked the safety goggles with that turn. So let's see if I get away with this. Rage Powder again. Yep, okay, all right. As long as they target my Flutter, I'm in a really good spot. Come on. Yes, they're convinced I'm safety, they're convinced I'm not safety goggles. Get rid of them. Didn't quite do it. Um, I'm cool with this though. I can just degleam. I just degleam. Hold on to you. Let's go into our palafin. Uh, do I do I hold on to Arcanine? Degleam will KO this flutter. But I don't I, I wanna hold on to my yeah, I think I think I get a lot of value out of this. Um My Bax is the most expendable thing. Oh, I don't have D-Gleam. I'm an idiot. What am I? An idiot sandwich. I'm an idiot sandwich. All right, well, now that they know I'm goggles, this is still safe. They shouldn't Rage Powder again, I think, and if they do, it's still fine. They do Rage Powder. That's all right. They hit their berry. Um, this Flutter main is on a timer. I have to be careful with Pollen Puffs, so I can't really play super defensively. I didn't bring my Tinglu either. Ooh, that's bad. I really have to get rid of this Amoongus first. Let's Glaive Rush and Protect. Hopefully I don't get full parried. Because I really need this. This will KO, I just need to not get full parried. Come on. Nice. Good spot to be in, good spot to be in. Because this Fluttermain is now within Ice Shard range, and I don't believe that I'm within Ice Shard range. There's their backs. Ooh, but here's the issue. Here's the issue. What's Ice Shard? I'm gonna save my Flutter, and I'm gonna Intimidate. And I think that'll help me win here. Because if I get full Parrot, I can lose on that turn. So I'm not gonna bet, I'm not gonna bet the house on it, you know? I need, I need to, I need to give myself a little bit of wiggle room. Because I can take another... I can take a, a Dazzling Gleam. I just can't take a, you know, a Moonblast. Uh, I'm full parrot. That's pretty bad. Oh, and I don't take a Dazzling Gleam. Okay. Oh, uh, that's really bad. Um, How do I get out of this situation? High School Spear. 
They're definitely loaded dice. That means that they might be Swords Dance. So I can bring in my Palafin. I can definitely bring in my Palafin. Okay, all right, all right. Uh, this isn't the worst. I still pressure the Fluttermane, and Palafin still comes in here. It's just a matter of surviving an Ice Shard, really. But I did lose my booster energy, so maybe not quite. Hmm. I guess I could protect here. Uh, let's just go for it. Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't get a lot of value out of protecting, but, um... Getting damage on Gyarados is, like, fine. Because it might be within a two-shot range, and I can make a pretty crazy call. No, nope, they do let me just take this away from them. And I, I think my Flutter can still take it. I think Flutter's fine. It might be AV is the issue. I'm going to haze in case they want to protect here, and I'm going to protect myself. Yeah, they totally ice sharded. They totally ice sharded. Let's get rid of this uh, attack drop. Do I eat this? That's the question. I don't know if I eat this. Um, I'm gonna get rid of my attack drop. I just kind of have to believe in him, don't I? Wave crash, jet punch doesn't really make a difference. Let's go for it. I don't think I eat this. But if I do, Fluttermane's broken. Fluttermane does not eat it. Is it possible to win? Probably not. This is a uh, my wave crash is resisted. If I can two-shot, maybe. Nah, that's game. They got me. They got me good. I just keep going for it. They do have Protect. Okay, well, I I, I was kind of convinced they were AV with the way they were playing this. But I guess I, we did see, like, Ice Spear, so they could have just been loaded dice. I guess they were just loaded dice. All right, we'll forfeit there. That's game. They, they got me good. I cannot lie. They got me good. All right. Forfeit that match. Good game. But uh, I think we had a pretty decent time with Bexcalibur Balance. I think we only dropped two games with it in this entire streaming session maybe three but we got way more wins than we got losses so i'm cool with it anyways they could just forfeit the game or end the game yeah we're good that's gonna be it for tonight's stream if you guys are watching on youtube be sure to leave a like subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video bye